Bonjour everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. Today's video we are doing a staple summer skin look. What do I mean about that? I mean I'm gonna use products that are my staples for summertime where I want my makeup to be long wearing but very lightweight on the skin. Not too much but at the same time my skin looks put together, my skin looks naturally radiant and using just products that works, that are long lasting, that are easy to use and especially when I'm very busy and I want to be out the door within 10 minutes that's the makeup I like to go for. So if you want to see those products in action I have a little mix of drugstore and high-end makeup so if you want to see them in action and you want to see the look that I'm gonna be creating for this summer staple skin makeup look that are long-lasting that slay and stay all day you know what to do just keep on watching <music> Okay, my lovelies, so first things first, what I like to do is of course to use a primer. I already did my skincare routine this morning, so it's really fresh, hydrating, plumped and nourished and good to go. So the primer I'm going to be using is the primer from Milk Makeup, is the Hydro Grip Primer. One of my favorite go-to primer, it's very well known, I really like it, it's long lasting, it is a gel formula, it has skin loving ingredient, it looks like so. One pump usually is enough for me and what I like about this primer is because it's gonna grip my makeup that's gonna make it last longer but it's also gonna hydrate my skin throughout the day so it's not gonna leave my skin dry or dehydrated and at the same time it's just gonna make my makeup be smooth on top of it and it's gonna also make my makeup last all day which I love so it's a really great primer and as you can see it has a bit of a grip which is great and this is what we want for our makeup to last longer. I like also to put a little bit underneath my eyes so it's gonna be a great prep for my uh, concealer so it's also a great little trick to do there you go next up i'm gonna use actually not a foundation because when i do this type of makeup i like it to be very lightweight really like barely there is nothing there on my skin but still my skin looks put together looks flawless and looks even out so i'm gonna use a product which is from nude sticks and it's the nudist tinted blur stick that i have in the shade five medium and what i like about this product it looks like so so it's a stick form like so as you can see it has a very velvety formula it's very lightweight barely see there you know and it has a really great finish to it it's very natural finish but at the same time it's gonna really even out my skin which that's what i want and what i like also is i can use it also as a concealer as you can see now and i like to just be generous generous <laughs> i like to be very generous with it because it's very lightweight as i said on the skin i really don't feel it at all and i don't really need to set it as well it's actually also set itself down which i love and it really takes me like one or two minutes which i love it really doesn't take too long and as you can see i'm also looking on my mirror so i know what i'm doing but you see you see how my skin looks even out i still can see you know my freckles my hyperpigmentation but it's fun because what i want is not to have a full coverage but really having even skin tone so i look put together and i look like my skin looks great on its own and i like that it's a great product see it's really great Look at that. Great, right? It just even out my skin tone. It looks like I have nothing on my skin. I don't wear anything. But yet, my skin looks even out, looks flawless. And anything that needed to be covered, it's taken care of. Even my, you know, dark circle, that's still covered a little bit. I really like that kind of look. It's the perfect no makeup makeup look. If you're looking for a product that really gonna achieve that no makeup makeup look, this is a really great product to try out. Then for my bronzer, I'm gonna be using my NAS bronzer, which I've been loving lately, and I know you know about it already. It's the Sun Kissed Bronzing Cream that I have in the shade Casino, which is the Laguna 3. I talked about it many, many times. I love the color. I love the undertone of it. It's really great formula as well. It's long lasting 
and a little bit goes a long way you don't need really much seriously just a little bit is enough it's gonna give you the sun kissed alley look that we want for summer time it's easy to blend very easy very very quick as well it smells super good it smells the mono it smells island oh boy i wish i'm on an island right now and the skin looks really good with it it works with any base you want to put on top of it so it doesn't have to be just foundation it doesn't have to be just the nas foundation it can work with anything even with nothing on you go straight with your bronzer it really work really well and as i said it gives you that really nice sun kissed look without too much effort it's like minimum effort maximum impact I really like it so much. Very natural when you use a little bit of it. It doesn't do much. And it really creates a bit of a dimension as well. Love it. What I'm going to do as well quickly, I'm going to use an eye brush. And I'm going to take a little bit of it, take the excess. And I'm going to quickly run through my crease. So it's nice and harmonious and cohesive and it makes my also eyes looks a little bit less naked and more cohesive just a tiny bit you see like so there you go. and as I said it's a really quick look that you can do on the go you don't have much time but you still want your skin to look great it's a really great, great product. Love it. Now for my blush, I'm going to use a cream blush from e.l.f. It's one of my newest blushes in my collection. It's the Luminous Putty Blush. And I have this one in the shade, let me find out, Isla de Sol. So it's a beautiful orangey shade, a perfect shade for summer. So that's why it's one of my staples, even though it's a newest blush for me. But I did try the formula with the Bermuda shade and I really loved it. So I know this one is going to be no exception. It's quite pigmented, but then when you put it on your cheek, it looks very, very nice. It's very blendable. It has this beautiful glow luminous finish to it. And it's just the perfect two in one because it also can be used as your blush highlighter as well so you don't need to have an extra step to use a highlighter to enhance your natural beauty this does the job perfectly i like to also go through my nose like so so it really makes the look very natural and again sun kissed and summery vibes you see look at this color it's very natural on the skin it's so pretty it's pigmented, sorry, but at the same time, very natural. So you really can work on the pigmentation of the blush. You can really share it out and you can also make it very more dominant. So you can have a stronger, a little bit on my eyelid as well, a little bit more, you know, pronounced if you want to, but also a very sheer kind of color on your cheek. You really can work with what you want on that day, you know. very pretty i really like this blush and i also have another shade i haven't tried yet i did swatch in on my instagram reel i did a reel about those blushes and it's the shade moe which is a very pinky everyday shade but very natural and i cannot wait to also try it out but this shade here it's the perfect summer staple shade for my cheek it really makes it glowy luminous bronzy but at the same time orangey it screams summer even though we are at the end of summer but we can still you know play with some summery color this is a really great product it's from the drugstore it's very inexpensive and it's a great 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 formula great texture great finish and amazing range of color as well then for my eyes i'm gonna quickly curl my lashes to make them a little bit more curly a little bit more elongated because i like that and then i'm gonna use a mascara from the drugstore, which is this one here that I've been loving. It's from Maybelline. It's the The Colossal Curl Bounce. It's a great formula. It's a great brush as well. And it really works really well on my lashes. It makes them voluminous. It also separates them and it thickens them as well. It's really a great, great, great drugstore 
mascara. And I use it only on my top lashes. I don't want to use any mascara on my bottom lashes because I don't want to ruin my under eye. So that's why I'm just using it on the top. And plus I feel like it's give more definition like so. It's really, really nice. You see how elevated, voluminous and separated my lashes looks like? This is all because of this mascara. It's such a pretty mascara. Then for my brow, I'm just gonna brush them through quickly with that brush from e.l.f. It's the, the Lash and Brow Wand. And it's a great brush to just brush them through and to also use it with the wax gel. But today we're not gonna use a wax gel. We're just gonna use a thickening mascara. And it's from NYX and it's the Thick It Stick It. I have it in the shade Espresso. Oopsie. <laughs> it's a great, great, great brow mascara i love it so much i take the excess off from the wand so it's not gonna be too much and it really thicken my brows it make them stay in place all day such a pretty brow mascara and it really does the job in few seconds doesn't take too long as you can see it make them even bushy i love that look then i use that brush again to clean up the mess if there's some or to just dress up the brows to make them the way I want them to be like so and I'm very lazy when it comes to my brows so I want something that works quick and it's easy to use and it's reliable throughout the day you see very nice I don't need much of the product and it does the job really really well and it really fills in my brow as well naturally and it makes them feathery bushy thick nice just love it there you go very quick <laughs> very quick and easy i really like this mascara so much it's a great great find from the drugstore my go-to now i love it so much now when it comes to lips, it changes every day. It really depends on how I feel that day, what my mood is about my lips, and sometimes it's just a clear gloss like this one that I love from Kosas. It's the Wet Lip All and I have it in the shade Jellyfish. I love it. It plumps my lips, it hydrates my lips, it's very juicy looking, wet looking. I love it. It has skin loving ingredients so it does hydrate it throughout the day as well. So I like to use this one on its own. Sometimes I like to use it with a lip liner as well. This one is from NYX. It's in the shade London. It's a great, great formula. It's also a great shade. It's an everyday nudish shade it really works well with any everyday lip shade i like to put on my lips or also any lip glosses any lip oil it really works well together but today i wanted to use a lipstick which is this one here it's a new lipstick from me it's from l'oréal paris and it's their intense volume matte and it's in the shade le mauve indomptable i love this shade it's a beautiful shade i love the packaging it's a slim packaging very chic very nice and the shade looks like so so as i said it's the shade mauve indomptable so it's a mauve color and it's just the prettiest everyday mauve it's long lasting it has a matte velvety finish it's very comfortable on the lips it's just very pretty i love it and i wanted to use this one because it's now becoming one of my staple as well because it's long lasting i love it because i don't have to think about it throughout the day and when i kiss my kids i don't leave any transfer it's very transfer proof it's very long lasting it's hydrating at the same time and it has that velvety comfortable feel texture to it on your lips so you don't feel like your lips get drier throughout the day they just stay comfortable all day long so what i'm gonna do first i'm gonna still line my lips just to give them a bit of dimension so i'm gonna use london you see it's like my lips but better it's very natural i'm just gonna give some definition like so such a pretty pretty everyday lip liner so very pretty. I really like this everyday lip liner. It's so, so gorgeous. Then I'm going to apply that lipstick. As you can see, it's so pretty as well. So comfortable on the lips. Isn't it pretty? If you want, you can add 
that lip oil if you want to just to give more dimension to, to your lips i was going to but actually it's so nice as it is i don't really need an extra layer of juiciness but just for the sake of this video i'm gonna show you how it looks like if i add a bit of a lip oil on top so what i like to do is i just like to touch it up like so stamp 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 on the center of my lips to make them a little bit more juicier and even though throughout the day the lip oil will fade it out of course but the, that matte lipstick will stay on that lip color that mauve lip color still gonna stay on my lips throughout the day so it's just gonna give that extra hydration and i really 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 like it so pretty and the last but not the least i'm gonna use a setting spray and we are going back to milk makeup and we are using the hydro grip line and it's exactly the grip set refresh setting spray and what i like about this is like it has the similar same ingredients as the primer so it's gonna hydrate my skin throughout the day but it's still gonna also set and lock my makeup in place all day long and i really like the mist of it it's just a great overall setting spray that also I can use throughout the day. When I see my skin that needs a little bit of refreshing, I like to use also that mist. It's just a gorgeous, gorgeous setting spray. I have the travel size, but I will definitely be buying the full size once I will be running out of it because it is that good. It's a beautiful setting spray, face mist for before makeup, after makeup, throughout the day just an all-in-one a gorgeous one and there you have it guys this is the final makeup look this is my summer staple makeup look that is gonna last that is gonna slay and stay all day that's the product i've been using a lot of camera as well it's really great product that's gonna really give your skin that beautifulness hydration but also plumpiness and really even out your skin but also it's gonna last all day those product really works wonder and it's just a great everyday look a summer everyday look it's quite minimal but at the same time it really makes your skin look better it really makes your face looks put together i really do love it it's a quick 10 15 minutes on the go because i was talking through the steps i was talking about the products why i love that so it did make the video last a little bit longer but usually within 10 minutes that look is done i'm out the door and i look put together i look flawless i look healthy my skin breathe summer so i really do like it i hope you did enjoy this video if it's the case don't hesitate to give me a big thumbs up it does help me a lot if you are new to my channel i hope you will consider subscribing before you leave if you have also your own go-to summer staple please let us know in the comment below share them with us i would love to hear as well about them and why not also train them myself and if you are familiar with the products i have used let me know as well in the comment below let me know your thoughts as well about them thank you again so much for for watching this video thank you for spending this time with me today it does mean a lot to me and i cannot wait to see you in my next video until then stay beautiful Mwah. bye